Alright, back on the camera now then. Put these gloves back on. Get that in the bin. Might empty this one. We got a good grip on the bag there. We just push it out. There we go. Now we've got a bag, I can start on the stuff that I wanted to do today, which is all this stuff here. I'm going to start at this end, as I said the other, I was going to say the other day, it feels like that long since I was here, but no. About 25 minutes ago, roughly. Um, was there much here? I don't know if I... I think this area here was pretty clean, wasn't it? It's just the rest of it. And a lot of bits of broken glass, which I need a dust pan for. See, if I could do this as a job, it'd be so much better. I'd literally spend, I'd do so much overtime. Just, you know, I could walk about with a little cart, uh, I don't put it on cart, have a dust pan attached to it, have like um, nails screwed in around the top edge, hang bags off of it. Oh, I could spend literally days just out here when I have a break. It's so, it's so satisfying tidying up places, you know what I mean? Getting them spotless. I mean, you're never going to get them spotless, but getting it near spotless to the naked eye. Um, but that area is clear anyway. Don't want to rant too much. I want to get on and clean. Ah, oh, lovely. I might rip that flappy bit off because it's annoying me. Get in there. Right, here we go then. Hopefully, you can see all this. You should be able to, I think. Not on the ultra wide setting. If not, then this video would have just been a fail, but at least I helped out nature a little bit. That's what I always kind of aim to do whenever I go out. Leave somewhere a bit tidier than I find it. I don't know where to start. I'm going to start at the back, I think, because the front's more easily accessible. There's a uh, Thing with a kid's name on a picture here. I'm gonna block blur that out obviously. Um, do I put that in the bin or do I report that? It looks like it's just, I mean you can see there it's just falling off of a, a board or something but uh, I've got a video of it. I'll put it in this bag it's going in the bin anyway so no one's gonna find it. If I need to report it I will. For now though I want to get down in the bush without harming the bush too much and grab that which is still either half full of monster or yeah half full of monster oh jesus that's grim oh. <laughs> that is disgusting plastic lid under there and yeah this is going to be the next 20 minutes half an hour I won't include all of it on the video, but what's that? From like a car seat or something? Elasticy material. Fill it that. It won't come out of the bag later, so I'll have to shake it out. I'll pull it out myself. Right, there's nothing else in the bush. There's a load of dog crap to avoid. I'm really sorry about the sniffing as well. It's not very pleasant. I think what I might do is I'll include this in the main vlog, but then I'll upload this separately as well. Bit of a shorter one. And I'd like to ask everybody watching to please pick up just a few bits of litter the next time you go outside. It can really help the wildlife of the world, makes life a lot safer for our wonderful pets, and of course, makes our own environment a whole lot cleaner too. Um, I mean, there's just so much everywhere. And it really is sad. But not enough people care, but I've been over this already in the main video, so I'm not gonna rant on again. Let's get into the bush there, because there's a can right at the bottom. What's that? Is that a small monster, isn't it? Yeah. Juice. I've only ever had, I mean I've had a monster for years, but I've only ever had the original one, the green one. So I don't know what any of these taste like. Is it actual like juice, like fizzy juice? Is that a thing? Fizzy juice? Um, I've got no idea. It's just everywhere you look, there's more plastic and 
Now that's plastic as well, it looks like paper but it's plastic. I've missed something there. Butter candy, that's um, worth it, is that into it? Do I bring the bag or do I leave the bag? I might as well bring the bag, I'll just find my way along the edge here. Chili sauce, chili dip. Where's that from? Ah, McDonald's. Ah, bloody cold, or whatever it is. I don't think it is. A, I don't know. It might be a cold. The worst of it's gone. It's just runny nose now, which is quite annoying. Where's that perfume? I'm not going to stray in my direction for obvious reasons. Lou? Anybody here? <laughs> Probably some people looking down at me thinking I'm a right nutter. Which wouldn't be totally wrong. But I'm a nutter on a mission at the moment. Trying not to harm the bushes whilst also trying to help the bushes is not the easiest of things to do. I don't want to push the branches too far that they break. And I'm hoping the camera hasn't been nudged at all out of direction, but it's inevitable that it will happen at some point. I'm definitely probably missing some um, some of the smaller pieces. It's just hard to manoeuvre under here with my back as well at the moment. I've got like a million problems and uh, doing this definitely doesn't help but it helps nature and so ultimately that helps me. I know I've gone about nature a lot but it's just what I'm very passionate about. Got just the receipts, we've got a owl poking the eye and we've got, um, I wonder what the view's gonna be like for this. Milk packet, jolly good. Now I wonder what the view's gonna be like because uh, I can see obviously all around. I'm, I'm thinking you'll just be able to see like the branches, which is not the best view, is it? But I'll have to do. We've got most of that. I think I might jump over the wall. It's the easiest course of action here. <gasps> I'm so freaking unfit and old and useless, but I made it. My knees are shot. I should pick up along here, really, but jump down into there. Yeah, we'll start off here. Still wearing the same trousers as yesterday as well. The ones that need a belt, and I need to actually buy a belt before I can use one. I have one somewhere, I just have lost it, and I had it for ages. Because this is the only pair of trousers that needs a belt. The other ones are all on the water. Well, they're not in a the wash, they're just wet at the moment. It's all drying for being in the wash. Um, there's so much. Well, that's not even little. No. There's some little bits. The leaves are kind of throwing me off here. Some of the leaves look yellowish, kind of off colours. And then there's little bits like that. I don't know if you can see that. I've just bloody. There it is. Little bits like that. There's no way to filter out of the ground, you know what I mean? It's just, it's always going to be there. A tag from a shop. I'm getting towards the front later, so we go on the back for now. Put the bag over here. Let me get into the bush. Uh, there's not a lot, there's a fag there. That's about it, it looks like. Did I get it? No, I didn't get it. Come here. There we go. Is that a fag? It's a, no, it's not. It's a cool something or other. No idea. Is that tile or plastic? Or That's tile. I'll leave a tile. Tile's fine. That's tile as well, I'm assuming. Yeah, that's tile as well. So that area is fairly clear. There's a well, right next to some dog poop. Just be careful where I'm putting my hands there. So much dog poop right there, jeez. Right. 
get into this area. Can't actually see anything under there. There's more around the other side there. Sorry, bush. Put the bag there. Grab that. Packet of uh, paracetamol, what was that? Ibuprofen. And there's something there as well, and the moss. Needles. Pine needles, that is not. Needle needles, thankfully, although I'm sure there's some unpleasant trees around here somewhere. I'm not going through there, so we'll go around the front now. I've done what I can for the back. Over there, I'm going to start at this end though. Ugh, just trying to hold this away from me, if possible. Don't know when the camera will die. We can go in what, 10 minutes now? So, I don't know if, uh, I don't know when it will run out, I don't know how much battery it's got left. Not like there's much in there, is it? Nah, never mind. I spoke too soon. See, so there's nothing there, there's nothing up there. There's a sauce pot there, there's a bag just to the right, I've noticed as well. Should have maybe bought the bag, didn't I think I saw this much rubbish on the way up. Loads of little bits of plastic. Scattered our runes. I try and keep some of that moss and stuff there, but I'm gonna put out the plastics. Um, right under this one. I wanna get a move on because I don't know how much battery's left as I just said and uh wanna finish the video on the camera ideally. Ugh. Come on, Bush, you can help me out a little bit here. Oh, that's went right up. <coughs> went right up the nose then. Like a COVID test. That was unpleasant. I think my best bet is to probably reach in further here because I'm not getting in any further to the left. Just two bits of plastic I'm gonna get. So I don't think I'm gonna be able to. I've got one, I think. I touched it somewhere. There we go. Can I get that as well? I don't know if you can see because I have to look away. It's gonna get poked in the eye. Uh, oh, there we go, I got it. Oh. Should have brought a tripod to get a different angle of that. Because that was funny and unpleasant, but. Oh, there we go. Almost lost my airpod as well, so I'm gonna stick that back in my ear. Should have got tissues, my nose is running. Nothing in there. I want to get this wrapper. Refrigerators again. Oh, there we go. Refrigerators, yep. There's a lot of sniffing and a lot of food bars in this video. Try to catch this can there. Who are me, dear? There's a bit of plastic, it looks like, on the side there. There we go. Jolly good. Commentary is probably awful. Just, yep, there we go. Plastic there, there we go, yep, yep. <laughs> but it's the message that is the important thing. Well, the commentary is not the message, I suppose. Well, that's looking a bit nicer there. under the bench, lots of wool, fluff. Uh, ba -ba -ba -ba. Plastic there. And there's something else under there as well. Two things actually, there's one further back. There we go. That's a vape thing, is it? What is that? Bloody Mary. Unicorn shake, I'm assuming that's a vape. Uh, Alright, stuff under here. Ketchup packet. Ketchup packet, look at that. I know my rubbish, sometimes.
used to love McCoy's chips, no McCoy's crisps rather. I haven't had them in years. That's full of water, I think. Lovely stuff. Can I find a tissue? Could use a blow of my nose. No, obviously I'm not gonna do that, that's disgusting. I can't even joke about that. That's grim. Do need to blow my nose there. Is that another one of those vape things there, is it? Yeah, what's that one? Lost Mary. Bloody Mary, Lost Mary. Very creative. What's that? No idea. Surprised I haven't found any of those um, little silver pellets. Don't know what they're for. They're usually a load around this area. I haven't found any today, surprisingly, so I suppose that's a good thing. Whoops. Well, that's pretty much that. Um, I do need to go home and get a tissue now, so I'll come back out and do some more litter picking tonight, I think. Not recording, because recording is great and all, but it does take up a lot of time. And so the next time I come out to record, I'm going to remember to bring a bag with me so that I don't spend ages wandering around. Load a little bits of plastic here. Oh, I'm really sorry about this thing once again. It's, uh, it really isn't nice to listen to. We'll call that a day for now, I think. Chuck all that in there. What do I get on there? It's quite a bit. I'll do a quick bit down there off camera. Um, and that'll be the end, I think. I'll do. Put the whole thing in afterwards. Yeah, I'll head down there. Get some stuff, and then uh, that'll be the end of the video. And that's the little silver pellet things I was on about there. I don't know, like some people I think say they're drugs. Some people I've said, oh, I've seen, have said there's helium in them. I don't really know. It seems a bit of a silly thing to put that much helium, but then I, I don't know. Comments will probably tell me what it is. I don't know. But uh shouldn't be there. That's what I do know. So it's going in the bin. It's not a huge haul, but it's a bit of rubbish cleaned up from over there. I'll do for now. Um I almost want to keep this bag because it's been really helpful. It's got a load of languages on as well. I love languages. Fair more motivation and smart. I learn loads, but so, a bit of pine needle in there. Sorry, Ben. But uh, yeah, that is that. Take my gloves off. Put them in my pocket. Ready for next time. Ooh, there we go. And that will be. Hopefully, I haven't just flipped you that way. Oh, flip, that's probably just being worse. Um, I think the tide is given out by the looks of things, so I mean, I could, if I wanted to, go over to the pier today. But no, I'll save that for another day. Um, yeah, that's it for this episode of Connor Picks Up Litter in Unofficial Ways. Hopefully, uh, everyone watching, if you're still watching at this point, uh, hopefully you just pick up just one piece of litter whenever you go out, you know, literally one piece. If everyone did that on the world, that's like seven, eight billion pieces of litter a day picked up. I know it's not ideal putting recycling in there. I mean, it says no recycling, but, you know, there's no recycling. Well, I suppose there's the MJ Church recycling bins. I don't know who they belong to, but, you know, I can't sort everything out with that cart or something, which I, I do want to get into. Eventually bring a cart, a couple of different bags for plastic, nets or whatever, but... Yeah, uh, if you could just pick up one piece of litter, put it in a bin. It can really help out the world. And, uh... Yeah, I will see you all maybe tomorrow. I don't know. We'll see. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one.